to it's winter time and uh, I'm not in the country obviously and I had this idea to uh, do a little series about um, the stuff that I'm putting together in this work table and since it's been a while since I've done uh, stuff uh, live with a camera like this the beginning is going to be awkward So, Tales from the Work Table was a little warm up. I think I got a bunch of uh, stuff that I made during my last creative binge and that haven't been photographed yet. So, let's make a little, little localized display here. And this one I, I have actually worn once already. Which way? This way. with different uh, little uh, scraps of uh, scraps of other pieces that I have assembled like this. A touch of metallic. Another piece of similar principle. Uh, again, sort of coiled up like this. Add a little bait. Um, I don't see if it's, uh, I don't know if it's visible in the video, but uh, this is basically a fine wire coiled up all the way and uh, there's a support wire in this. Uh, I really like this one. Oh hey, the sun is out. The one which actually the glass bit is, uh, is pretty old. I put this one together during one of those uh, um, organized craft workshop trips uh, when I was working at school. But that's that's how I roll. I have these uh, pre-made pieces or components uh, sitting in my drawers and uh, drawers and jars for years and years and years and then suddenly poof I put them all together. This one's a very simple piece. But they very similar in principle. And this one I put together like I don't know a week ago. Again the amber and wire piece was uh, was waiting years I think. There's another one to the dangly coily camp. Again this bundle, harsh part of this bundle or the, the heart of this bundle. I made this years ago but I have been adding some bits and then balancing it out and, and again using this sort of Oils on coils on support to put it together. And these here are the works in pro progress. I mean, more like works in compilation. They usually dependent the dangly bits have been made a long time ago, and now I'm just sort of providing them with uh, with the support. And also, I think I should mention that uh, plenty of the dangly bits and stuff uh, are made of stuff that I have found uh, from the ground. For example, this uh, twisted metal inside. I think I was walking uh, from um, from a friend's place to home and uh, and saw it in the street and picked it up. Oh, and look, pink and uh, the. Butterfly silhouette this is also found from the ground. This is one of my first like proper proper pink shit things. And here's some some bony bony bits.
what I need to do here now is to attach this this part same way that I have done with this one and uh, I'm not doing this with uh, with factory made crimps like these but instead I'm going to coil my own little sort of messier wormy thing and uh, and crimp that one use one or two more connectors. I mean it could be a wee bit longer the uh the beady part I mean yeah Now these slip made coil crimps can be very exact and they can be very neat but in this case I'm trying to get a little bit more quote unquote rugged look. So okay they all aligned the same way anyway. Just squeeze very, very firmly. Can shape them a little bit afterwards, but not too much. It's copper wire, so manipulating it too much might might break some bits. is flattened out a little more. some wire and various transparent beads. Yep. And uh, this concludes my first awkward uh, entry in the series and notes from the work table or tales or logs I haven't decided yet. Uh, next up, I mean next time, this process here but that's next next time for now thank you for watching and bye bye now before I lose all daylight a little addendum to this episode uh, the first awkward episode uh, I have also started putting together a uh, rope piece I don't know what to call this the, the necklace part for this pendant and here I have done the uh, homemade uh, coil crimping in a more mm, it's in focus more, in a more uh, neat manner. So yeah, uh, if you're careful, it's possible to uh, to do this sort of uh, little technique in a very 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 neat way. That's it for today.